is Master Turton's best bed. His guest bed, which you will find in the back parlour. Master Turton has many relatives and they often come and stay and will sleep in this fine bed in Master Turton's parlour. One day, a strange looking Master Turton appeared at the house. My Master Turton said that he was a distant cousin, um, but I had never seen him before. He looked rather careworn, and although he looked quite young in other ways, he looked very old as if time had really taken its toll upon him. So we gave him some pie, and we gave him some of Master Turton's ale, and he went to bed. And of course, we thought nothing of it. The servants went off to their slumber. And Master Turton and Mistress Turton went to bed in their fine bed upstairs. In the morning, when some of the servants came down, in order to prepare the house for the day, they came into this room. And it was very strange. There was a, an odd odour in the air. The food upon the table had crumbled and rotted as if it had been left there for weeks rather than had only been from the night before. The wine had evaporated and was just left with a strange residue at the bottom of the goblet as if it had been left on the table for months. It was as if time had jumped somehow. There was cobwebs and dust. And as they pulled the curtains back of the bed, they found Master Turton's cousin had died in the night. This, although shocking, was not unheard of, but the body had a strange look on its face. A look of fear and dread and shock. But not only that, the body was sucked of all moisture as if it had been mummified, as if the body had lain there for months and months on end untouched. It was as if the room had jumped several months in the night. The body was removed and the house cleaned. No one ever spoke of it again. <laughs>